What's up, YouTube? Here we are on the job, tree job, crane job, and it's me and Joe today. We're gonna uh, put the thing on the ground and then the crew will come behind us and chip it. And then we'll be off to other things. Spent $400 putting diesel in this crane, in this boom truck today. And it makes me, it makes you think when you're, when you're headed to a job that's a, that's a big chunk out of, out of what you're going to get paid and I haven't really thought about changing my price as much in a long time but that that'll make you forced to so <clears throat> yeah so yeah four hundred dollars for the boom truck and there's a lot of other tanks around here that have to be filled. <sighs> Got a feeling this world's getting a little too woke, you know? Let's do some tree work. That always puts me in a better place. So the approach to the tree is just solid poison oak. So we'll drop him in and lift him out so he doesn't have to deal with the oak. What are you doing here? You came to haul brush? Run the skids too. <laughs> I brought more cones. I'm just the cone guy. Oh, you're the cone head. Yeah, I'll put the cones down and then peel out. Okay. Now I figured you guys would be useless without a guy on the ground, so I would just cut all the brush off and then put the brush in piles just to the side of the road. Oh, you're gonna help us? Yeah, my first estimate's at one. Oh, okay. I set it up so, I, so that because I didn't, I thought it would suck if you guys didn't have somebody on the ground. Uh, so I was gonna cut everything off and stage brush and piles just to the side of the road. Okay. And then. Uh, uh, yeah, I didn't know. I brought my saw. I brought the skid steer. I brought the 500. So. All right. Samurai Joe Boyd rocking the. Monkey Beaver 2.0 saddle, totally modular. Can put the uh, storage D's anywhere you want on the harness. You can put your saw storage anywhere you want if you're right-handed, left-handed. You can put your doodads and whatnots anywhere you want. Back support, suspenders, sweet setup. He's got the adjustable bridge here that we don't we don't sell it this way, but a lot of ingenious, crafty little uh, tree climbers can do that on their own. Figure that out. Yeah, see, adjustable bridge makes it super nice when you need to rope walk SRT up. Yeah. You tighten this up all the way. Show him, Joe. Oh, I just unhooked. I was gonna climb out for a second. Oh, okay. I just snug it up yeah snug see look this is how long his bridge is now right now and then everything is tight when you're yeah. walking so because because with a, a non-adjustable bridge you yeah. got this this you is know like... puts this up here in your teeth yeah yeah anyway we like the adjustable bridge you can too if you do it on your own we don't sell them that way monkey beaver harness monkeybeaver.com joe hey. boyd the mastermind YouTube, this is how I interact with you. Comments. Well, I'm waiting for Joe to set up the slings here up there. Tree guy is my favorite, but I tell customers with an English accent, arborist. I'm an arborist. Jared Jones. Chaz D, can I get a clear prop, please? Chaz, class D, I said clear. Clear. You want me to say prop? I'm the only one on the ramp. I said clear. Uh, tree works CH. Ha. Tree of candy life? Actually, I think that in my country, if you want to become an officially approved arborist, you have to do a formation of at least two years, and you need to be already trained in some kind of green work. Yeah, this is what I talk about meddling government there, uh, tree works. 
uh, it gets more and more and more silly until pretty soon uh, you can't afford to work. Uh, Pablo Gutierrez, I said that arborist is not just being a good climber and cut trees with the certification you proof that you have the acknowledge about trees. I think Pablo is using a uh, voice uh, to English, uh, some sort of translate, and it it makes it it shows words I can read, but not in a in a formation that I can understand. Davy boy, tree guy, okay. Gray squirrel tree service. A agree. I don't like the charges every three years, but let's face it, if you are a certified arborist, you definitely have proof of your professionalism to some extent. I agree. Also, uh, it can boost your confidence when you're on a bid, because i tell you what doesn't boost your confidence is before you're certified, but you are qualified, and then they say, are you a certified arborist? And you're like, no, but, and then you go into a thing that sounds like excuses, even though it's all the gospel truth. So yeah, I gotta go. I'm not sure what they want. Yeah, I'm here. Did we lose you? He just whipped a Yui and left. He gave me the peace sign and he had a big smile on his face. All right on. All... You must have gave him the, Chill. do you know who I am speech. <laughs> I did. <laughs> He saw that monster tree service shirt and he was like, I'm out. Much. Yeah, he doesn't want no Merlot hug. <laughs> yeah. Uh, another great video, just typing out loud, but isn't an arborist anyone that works with trees? You may not be certified as one, but anyone professionally or otherwise doing tree care as an arborist, watching your videos have made me want to get into tree work. If I do, would I get certified eventually knowing I would give some customers a certain peace of mind? Thanks again for the great content. Philosophy, freedom, guns, and origami. You can call yourself anything you want. True. You can. Especially nowadays. Nowadays. I identify. <laughs> I identify as an arborist. I identify, <laughs> I identify as a certified arborist. And I'm not paying. So, yeah, you can call I yourself whatever you want. Better but I identify as. All right, pick up on her. Look, listen, the, the whole point is you can be a dang good qualified guy and not be certified. And you can be a terribly unqualified, cheating criminal hack and be certified, okay? and all points in between. Are you ready, Joe? Oh, he's still getting ready. I'll, I'll read another comment. Anye Castoza. Oh, and again, philosophy, freedom, guns, and origami. Yeah, I'd say get it because it will open doors for you. Yeah, and what did you say there? Knowing I would give some customers a certain amount of peace of mind, a certain amount. Well put, well written, agreed. The content just gets better. Read that, that was con. Kanye Castoza, thank you, sir. James B, yes, thank you for the ISA cert rant. Love you long time. You are not a horrible dictatorship yet. ISA, love you long time. You're doing a great job. You're not a, a horrible uh, dictatorship quite yet. Yeah, it allows you to do city work, which I don't even like doing. But anyway. You uh, pay extra to get certified and so Yeah, and then they take the lowest less. bid. Yeah. That way you can get paid less. Exactly. All right, Joe wants tension. Let me finish this comment. Hang out, Joe. Having liability insurance does not make me a better tree man. It does not make me a more competent climber. It just convinces people that don't know any better, mostly. My competence as a climber and my safety record for rigging trees off other people's roofs without damage should speak for themselves, but this is not a perfect world. Common sense is no prerequisite to owning things and doing stuff. And after 25 years of doing dangerous stuff safely, I still have to prove myself to some degree to an, another to people that just don't know any better if I want to continue to eat. Just the way the world is, I guess. But I am sure thankful to hear someone I respect to give their two cents on the subject. Thanks. Yeah, when it comes to insurance, though, I, I believe that's like loving your neighbor to have insurance when you're working over their stuff. Yeah, I really like that. It, it, it agrees with my whole life uh, philosophy. 
But anytime it's compulsory, oh, never mind. Listen, I gotta go. I gotta do some work. Here you go, August. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. I gotta show you guys the brush pile over here that Damien made for Adam and Jeff to uh, find. study showing that women who carry a little extra weight live longer than men who mention it. I'm gonna live forever. Well be careful you could even get in trouble saying that because you could be implying that you're withholding something that you're not saying something that you could say and thus living forever. No 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 there's there's nothing to say there's a uh, um, hole digging hole. Lucky. 